and now in this video we will talk about uh, how we can create files using cat command and also we will see some other operations using cat command okay so uh, let me increase the size of the terminal I think now it's fine and I will just uh, open up my file system in my left hand side to be more clear with the, you guys okay so now what we will need to do uh, we will we will have to learn about uh, cat command okay so basically cat command uh, we can use to create files and also we can use this cat command to like concatenate some more files together or you can say like merging more than one file in a one single file okay you can also do it in this and also uh, we can use it like uh, like to get the how many uh, numbers like to show the lines and all those things in this in the particular files okay so now we will start with the creating file okay so let me do first ls so i think i have some files directory let me check what is there okay file on file 4 okay i know what is uh let's create some files with cat command okay so cat i will go with the test 1.txt and what uh, here the main benefit is that we can simultaneously write whatever we want to write in that particular test file so here I am just writing this is test1 file okay in txt format and what you have to do you have to just hit enter and then control T okay so in this way we can create files okay and uh, now what we have to do we have to do ls and here you will see test1.txt has been created for you and here also you can see it okay now now the other feature of cat command is that like uh, you can also read the contents of that text file so how you can do it you can just cat and then the whatever the file name is there you can provide it okay that test1.txt i will hit enter and here you will see the whatever is the content of the file um like it is being printed here okay so uh, this is the like two operations we covered and now what we will need to do uh, I will create one more file okay uh, cat uh, test2.txt okay and here I will write this is test2 file in txt format okay he just hit enter and then control d and now what we will do we will see the content of test2.txt and here you can see this is test2 file in txt format okay now what we will i uh, need to do uh, what i will do i will try to uh, like concatenate uh, like uh, what you can say test uh, test2 content in test1 okay so how i can do it cat test1.txt then again this redirection operator this is called redirection operator and test2.txt hit enter i will try to see the content of first uh, test1 let's see what is there okay so basically this command like uh, will append in test2.txt not in text1 sorry for that okay test2 and here you can see like the whatever the content of test1 file has been included in this particular test2 file okay from here you can see also like when i will just hit uh, double click on it and here you can see the same thing here also okay so this is the uh, one way of uh, like uh, appending uh, two files together okay and what we can do uh, if we want uh, uh, like uh, append content of those file in another some file like suppose like test 3 file so what we will do we will there is just simple uh, cat uh, test 1.txt test 2.txt and then I think just uh, redirection operator and here we will write test 3.txt and now what we will do we will see here like test 3 has been created also when we will do ls here you can see test 3 has been created now what we will do I will try to read the content of test 3 test3.txt okay oh. so here you can see the content of both the files like this is showing test 1 two times because in test 2 uh, it was there like this was the content of test2 file okay 
so in this way we can uh, like merge multiple files uh, as many you want okay and uh, now uh, moving uh, forward uh, like uh, now we will learn about uh, some uh, like uh, what we can say little bit uh, options which we can use with this cat command so first option i will uh, i want to show you is cat hyphen n test3.txt so this command basically what it does it uh, uh, basically like show you the lines with number wise okay here you can see this is first line this is second line this is third line and similarly here also you can see the uh, like uh, all those things like one two three okay so this is the one way uh, to uh, like get the files by number wise and if you want to uh, check the like uh, end where is the ending of that all the lines then at that time it will show you the dollar character at the end of the line okay here you can see like here the line is ending that's why it is showing dollar here what if we will do uh, here I will change little bit uh, like here I will change like uh, this is uh, another file and I will just hit control s and full stop also and let me cut this and here you can see the line is ending here okay so I hope you got it uh, why it's showing dollar dollar is because like here at this point of uh, line uh, sentence or at this point of word uh, thus the uh, line has been ended so here uh, that's why here it is swing dollar okay so this is the uh, basic use of uh, hyphen e command okay and now uh, what uh, if you want to add uh, like uh, uh, some more content in a uh, like previous file previous file it means like it is already created you don't have to create anything for it so for that you don't have to do anything uh, you have to just uh, apply double redirection of that is this one cat and suppose I want to write in test1.txt okay and here first we will see the content of this so here you can see this is test1 file in txt format and I have to write uh, something like uh, this is a tutorial based on Linux uh, cities or something like that okay and just hit control d okay and i will just uh, like uh, reopen this particular file mm, okay so here you can see like uh, this is tutorial based on linux has been uh, like added in this particular test1.txt file okay and uh, uh, there is also one uh, like uh, option which we can see uh, like uh, hyphen t option okay so basically what it does uh, it will show you the tab like where uh, where is the tab in the particular line okay so what do i will do now i will just uh, like uh, give a tab here okay one tab two tab Three tab I am giving here okay and just control s and the tab will be represented by this this symbol I think let's see what uh, it shows cat file one dot uh, sorry what is the file name okay test one dot txt test one dot txt okay so uh, this is the content which we saw and now what i will do i will just have to use the hyphen t option and here you can see uh, this is uh, the particular symbol and i i i it's showing like three taps is there it is showing that's it okay so uh, uh, that's all about uh, like uh, this cat command okay i hope you liked it and if you have any issue or if you are facing any problem any kind of confusion then you can ask us in comment section and yeah please do like share and subscribe our channel okay thank you thank you for watching we'll meet in the next video